Hi folks, welcome back to the channel. So today, a quick video. Um, I've got a new bag. Ta -da. So this is a Tama power pad drum bag, but it's actually the bag for their drum throne. It's from this series. And this is a PBTH 15. Okay. You can fit the throne and um, throne base within the bag. So I'm actually quite impressed with these bags. I've got the one that comes with the classic hardware, the small hardware bag, which I'll do a separate uh, review video on. Um, but I thought I'd just show you um, a little bit more about this one. So here it is. It's quite well made. And you've got to start off with this lovely zip pocket which actually goes both sides at the moment i've just got my in-ear um, defenders in but you can put all sorts in there so as we open it up you can see zoom you out a little bit nice sturdy zip quite hard to do this with one hand to be fair but opens up nicely. Now, I've actually got more than just the throne in this. So this is my Tama first chair backrest, sorry, throne base. I've had this for years, to be honest, really good thing. And then in here, you can see there's a separate compartment and that's a really sturdy flap, to be fair, really sturdy. It might even be some sort of metal in there. Um, now the idea is that you keep your throne base in it separately and I've wrapped it in a towel just for protection you do have to collapse it fully but that's okay so I've wrapped it in this towel for no particular reason to be fair because it's very well padded in there that folds up like this now I've got a few extra sticks in there more about that in a moment but this um, let me just see if I can do this with one hand this fits in here like this easily Separated, folds up, zips up. And once you zipped it up, you've got a really nice handle. And then this shoulder strap is actually really sturdy. So I don't know if you find that when you're putting your throne in with the rest of your hardware, it doesn't make the hardware bag really heavy, particularly if it's a good throne, but also the actual um, leatherette of the throne can get scratched or even ripped by the stands. And that's why I quite like having it um, separate. So you can also, it's marketed in that you can actually keep a snare drum in it. Now, the other thing that I've got is room for a tiny stick bag. Because if you're doing a festival gig, say for example you're doing a festival gig and you have to take what's traditionally breakable, so snare, throne, sticks, pedals, cymbals, often you'll find that perhaps if it's in a town centre, I've got one this weekend, it's in a town centre, you have to park and then walk to the venue. Um, having this throne bag where you can just carry your throne and actually a small stick bag in the same bag, um, it actually saves you quite a lot of um, journeys to and from the car. So, there it is. And obviously as you're carrying it, I mean, it is quite heavy, but it's a well-built bag. The stand itself, of course, is also quite heavy. The stool itself is also quite heavy. But to be honest, you can put it on your shoulder and you can really manage it quite easily. So I can really think that you could carry your cymbals, your stool, your snare, your pedals, you could go to a festival gig or a gig where you're sharing the kit all in one journey and it really wouldn't be a problem. So guys, thanks for watching. I'm gonna be uploading quite a few more reviews of bits of equipment that I've got. I'm gonna do a review of the classic um, hardware, the lightweight stuff that they've got um, from Tama. Um, I'll also do a review of this new little stick bag and I've got coming next week, quite excitingly, a um, three shell, three piece shell pack um, of the Stammer, the Tama Star Classic um, Walnut Birch in, I think it's Molten Raspberry Fade. So a 20 by 14 bass drum, um, a 12 by eight Tom, 
rack tom which is mounted on the bass drum and also there's a 14 by 14 floor tom so that's going to be really exciting and um, so i'll do probably an unboxing video on that um so anyway cheers for watching for now um and uh, subscribe to the channel um to get regular updates and of course hit the like button because it really does help the channel out and thank you very much for now cheers then bye